Hi, my name is Mike Capuccio, and um, I'm here today to explain to you um, how to integrate your system with a Mitsubishi Kumu Cloud controller station and the Kumu Cloud. Okay, um, there's been a lot of questions and a lot of conversation going on now about, hey, what are all these Kumu Cloud stations and all these controls, and you know, how do I integrate this with my boiler and you know, how do I put this together? And you know, there's been some significant rebates that have just been released from Mass Save starting January 1st that are up to $1,600 a ton. Not even up to $1,600, they are $1,600 a ton when you integrate this with your Kumu Cloud Station. So I want to show you pretty much what you would do and how to do it. Real simple, um, you would put this Kumu Cloud Station in your home, okay? This is basically what's either going to turn your boiler on or off, depending on the outdoor air temperature, okay? We found that above 20 degrees, um, 20 to 25 degrees, that if you heat with an air source heat pump, it's much more efficient than a gas boiler, an oil boiler, a propane boiler, whatever you're trying to use, it's definitely more efficient to heat at those temperatures with an air source heat pump. That's not to say that an air source heat pump can't heat when it's zero degrees out. We do have products that do do that. I've spoken to you about and I've spoken to you about that in previous videos with hyperheat is, but that's not what this video is for. Okay, this is intended to show you what a Kumu Cloud Station does. Again, there's four channels on it. The four channels are what run the four circulator pumps in your house or your four thermostats in your house. We would be integrating that with this station, okay? So this red light is simulating your boiler, okay? So I'm gonna show you what would happen, you know, below 20 degrees, 25 degrees, your boiler's gonna work. And all this station is doing is switching it over with temperature, on, off, on, off with temperature to heat your home with the most efficient system that you would want to use to heat your home with, okay? So above the temperature, the air source heat pump comes on. I'm switching it on and off, but it would be doing it from a sensor that goes outside. There is an outdoor air temperature sensor that ties into the Kumu Cloud Station that goes outside, okay? You do have to run 24 volts to it, little transformer, little 110 volt step down, goes right into it, powers it up. And then everything is run off of the Kumu Cloud app for the indoor units that you would put in for the air source heat pump. So you can see right here, I have it on my tablet. This is one indoor unit. This is one of the GL15s we have here in the training center that that's running off of. And you can see I can turn the temperature up and down on that, whatever I want to do with, with the Kumu Cloud Station. So we put a Kumu Cloud app on each in, indoor unit that we're going to tie into each zone. And that's pretty much what we do with the Kumu Cloud Station. It just really is a switch that operates on temperature and puts your most efficient heating system on um, depending on what the outdoor air temperature is.